Hey Shannon, hey Fatima. How are you? Are you still the revised intro? <laughs> Yeah, we decided it needed a facelift. Shannon, you had Shannon, you had pizza last night. You had pizza last night, Shannon. Anyway, figured I would finish this painting that Bruce and I well. He finished his, but I started mine last week. So, now that I have watercolor paints, corned beef, no corned beef, no, 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 no corned beef. Hey, Linda. Yeah, new brushes. I don't have to use my acrylic brushes for my watercolors. Or vice versa. Not a fan of corned beef. No. Linda. Linda. Just because, just because, just because, just because. Yeah, Shannon fell down again. Ha ha, Taco Sunday, ha ha. See, I knew you would, I knew you would do it. I knew you would do it. And she laughs at me because it's usually Thursday. Hey, Rob. It's what she needs, right? She needs some bubble wrap. It was still not a Tuesday, Fatima. It still wasn't a Tuesday. You still broke tradition. I knew you'd come over to the dark side. Oh, I'm sorry, Linda. Hi, Bruce. Tuesday only, Ethan. <laughs> okay, Shen. See, Fatima. Fatima had them on Sunday. She came over to the dark side. over to the dark side. Hello, Facebook user.
No, Rob, you're not, no. 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 No, no, no. Oh, hey, Diana. Yeah, it doesn't show your name. For some weird reason. Is there an unwritten rule you have to have tacos on a Tuesday? If so, I'm a lawbreaker and I'm calling BS. <laughs> That's what I say. Tofu ice cream. Is it Oreo again? Tar. had to have one back alley brawl today. I bit my tongue and sat on my hands. Maybe that's the wrong yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your family eats them on different days. I insist on changing the world to Taco Thursday. Not the whole world. Just, you know. The whole world, maybe. The country. The, you know, 48 contiguous states, anyway. Alaska and Hawaii don't have to participate. I believe the polite version was I suggested someone put something in their own in their coin purse forcefully. Yes, yo. Hold on, this is gonna rival Jim's rant. <laughs> Rob has a rant. Bruce says, oh, hi, old person, Jim. He said, oh, hi, old person, Jim. <laughs> Nothing rivals Jim's fabulous hair, and I, for one, am envious. <laughs> oh, yeah, you, you, you never sent me the rest of that, Rob. Clothing kept murder in check couldn't fulfill a stereotype. I played nice. <laughs> well, you know.
They're talking about your harem. No, Fatima is, is, is apparently jealous. You mean ninja? We know Fatima is a secret ninja and she just pretends to be nice. I'll tell you when you're off, you may do a few squares of unbelievable stupidity. This is a new level. <laughs> God. Well, you know, Rob, you did say that there was a 5150 involved, so, you know, I know what that is. Ellen is mixing drinks. <laughs> She's like, yeah, some people may need these. Bruce is sad he's out of chocolate for his ice cream. Now what are you going to do? Oh yeah, my co my ex coworker was the same way, Fatima. She would teach us all the bad words. We have ice pops in the freezer of the camper. He's gonna melt chocolate bars. <laughs> that works. With marshmallows. Yeah, there you go. And this son and her took sign language classes. I've forgotten so much. Oh, it is funny. It is quite funny. All right, let's see. Poor kids ain't getting no candy from me. <laughs> you got a couple of weeks yet. You can always restock if you need to. Fatima played with non-shedding glitter paper. <laughs> hey, Diana. Welcome to the rant session of Garden State Paint. <laughs> Feel free to air all your rants. I'll sit here quietly eating my tofu vanilla gluten-free dairy-free ice cream. <laughs> yeah, it's not an ice cream. It's actually a frozen dessert because there's no dairy. <laughs> Bob's having campground kids relocated for work. They will be used to improve the underground stability of the pool. <laughs> wow.
Whatever, Jim. <laughs> About his ice cream. He said... <laughs> he said, don't pop my bubble. <laughs> Depends on what the carton says. Let him have his ice cream and be happy. <laughs> Especially in California. Only in California. It says, he said the carton says frozen dessert. <laughs> Jim, I would like you to do one YouTube approved swear because everything I've got will have the internet shut down. Mother of Pearl. <laughs> My communications teacher used to say that all the time. Sweet mother of pearl. Although he did say the other stuff, but yeah. <laughs> Rob said cheers. <laughs> <laughs> no, it does not say that on the carton, and it's vegan. Well, it's got to say something on the carton. It's got to say frozen dessert or ice cream or whatever. Tofu frozen treats. Oh, okay. I, I don't think he's got to worry about that, Linda. <laughs> he may have plenty of and chromosomes, just saying. Our snick is organic, yet I don't want to consume it. Bruce doesn't have any hormones. What? Wait. It says pretend ice cream. Yes, I pull her. So basically, Bruce has a bowl of disappointment and hatred with vanilla flavor. <laughs> yep, there you go. Because he doesn't have any chocolate. He 
He's out of chocolate, Rob. Wow, everybody's just like ragging on Bruce's ice cream today. I'm not done dirtying a bowl. Carton is now empty. Oh, he ate it right out of the curtain. He's like, I already did the dishes. I am not doing any more dishes today. Bruce has a treat that does not make Bruce spend the next week near the bathroom. There you go. That's important. That's important. Because that's not fun. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. I know the answer to that question. Oh, damn, Fatima, wow. <laughs> Don't hold back, Fatima. back today. She, her filter may be broken. Rare form today. <laughs> no, Fatima, I think he was going to give Linda a description. I think that's how it went. I may know someone who took normal tractor tires off and installed snowblower tires on his tractor. Yeah, that's a good way to recycle. The 
fronts. I may have broken a finger when the drill caught, but hey, that's not anything. Did you really break your finger? Should be a standard option. I hope you didn't really break a finger. Is it supposed to be straight or at a 45 degree angle? Uh, uh. Thinking straight. I'm just guessing though. Does it feel broken? I mean, I think you wouldn't know if your finger was actually broken or not. Maybe it identifies as biangular. <laughs> <sighs> Only him. Only him. Just saying. Well, it's not swollen like it's broken. You might have dislocated it. But it's like... Yeah, I mean, if, you're, if it was broken, it would be a lot more... It doesn't even really look swollen. He said, oh yeah, let me reset it. Hurrah! <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah, pop that puppy back in there. Pop that puppy right back into place. Okay, all better. Damn, that hurt, but hey, it's better. See? That will be... No, Bruce dislocated his finger. He thought it was broken. 
He sent me a picture. I said, it's dislocated. Pop it back into place. And that's exactly what it was. 20, $25 copay, please. <laughs> I mean, he's dislocated enough things, he should have known that. Switching tires from the snowblower to the tractor. <laughs> Chip's not gonna ask. <laughs> he's just going with it. <laughs> Bob, you can always move here and work for Andre. Although you probably get really upset about that too. So. Kind of between a rock and a hard place right about now. Snowblower has knobby 10 ply tires and two inches taller. Why waste good turf tires, right? Right. Probably Kenbers. Quarter fill them with water and any freeze. You'll have a wonderfully capable off road snowblower. <laughs> you knew it wasn't that difficult. Ooh, I get another one. Aw, the baby. That's just a cutie. The kitty, baby. I 
I did melt totally. I have a big puddle on the floor. What happened to the snow blower named Crystal? Who is Crystal? Um. Because I'm still new at this. I guess that could be done like that. First, do the snowman's part. Real answer is she got hit by snowballs, but I'm adult now. <laughs> you're, you're being an adult. Ew, adulting is overrated. What the heck? Why is that video so damn loud? I don't understand why they do that. <laughs> what did you expect me to do? Because <laughs> I knew you weren't even telling the truth. You don't adult very much. You only like... Three hours out of the day. <laughs> you so do not adult. Oh well, that's their problem. Bless you. Normal's overrated, too. Shannon went to the urgent care. I think Linda's still here. Just guessing.
Are you coming to visit? Rude. Rude. You did that already, it doesn't count. You did that like last year. Who's everyone? Anyone with the not chicken feathers? Oh, the not chicken feathers to paint. I just put my chicken costume on. Why do I get capital letters? He's just naming everybody. I didn't see Anthony's name in there. <laughs> oh, mine, mine are already like that, Rob. So he wouldn't be doing anything new.
you'd actually have to make it exciting. Yeah, he, <laughs> exactly, that's what I'm saying. I saw that. Does your does your pour glow in the dark? No? That sucks. Yeah, totally. I was kind of like looking forward to see that. Uh, okay. Maybe, I guess that should have gone on last, like on the top. I guess. I mean, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know anything about pouring, but I'm assuming that it should have been. The last color to go on. So should the white have gone on as the last color? Oh, you were thinking, okay. What can you paint that is dark that I have not done? Um, have you done, <clears throat> have you done a spooky castle yet in a thunderstorm? I don't remember. I vaguely remember a castle. I oh, a bunch. Okay. Damn. I vaguely remember a castle that was way in the background. On a ledge or something.
<laughs> oh, okay. That's where I thought. Holy crap! I said, holy crap. <laughs> You've done a Reaper, yeah. You've done the Black Cloak person. Oh, the video? It's in Italian. It was a rally race or something. But they feel like they have to yell. I, I don't get it. Did a pumpkin. Yeah, I think the Reaper glued in the dark, too. Evil candy corn? <laughs> I'm getting a mental image. That's pretty funny. Now these are um, these are formula. I don't know what the hell they are. Some kind of rally, twenty-four hour. Uh, some sh I don't know. The fifty worst motor crashes, but they're none of them are in America. Europe has the best worst crashes. Have the best worst crashes ever. 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 Yeah, and they, they get pretty excited about it there, huh? Just saying.
Bruce is currently looking through pictures to see what he can paint. Be rallying the only safety margin was how fast you could get out of the way, right? Right? I don't know, Finn. I really don't know. Can't answer that question. I can't go for that. No, no kidding. <laughs> that was the exact image that I had. <laughs> Maybe put a, um, like a really worn out, patched up hat on his head or something. <laughs> can, can you put that on there too? How do you know? Did you ask one? When's the last time you talked to a candy corn? Bandana wearing snack. <laughs> wow. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm, I'm glad you guys have a, you know, have a personal relationship with candy corn. I, for one, don't like candy corn. It's pretty freaking nasty taste. The idea for the painting is cute, but I don't like to eat them. I don't paint pots very well. Yeah, you could do a, a Venus flytrap. Yes, I said Venus, not the only other word. Not the other word. I said Venus. Hmm. Let 
wonder if I need a narrower bush. Yeah, let's use a narrower bush. Why is November 1st gonna be grumpy face? Oh, because we have to close the camper, that's right. No, October 31st will be Grumpy Face Day. Never mind, took me a minute. Why does he have a smile on his face? That's freaky. What the heck is in his mouth? Is that a fly? That's freaky. He got lost. Oh, it's a leg, okay. Oh yeah, Monday he's gonna go look for it because the Barnes and Noble here in town closed, so he's gotta go over to the other one and see if they have them. We already had that discussion. Bob needs his bi yearly dose of weird New Jersey. No, these are the watercolors, Bruce. The watercolors. I was I turned the easel because I had to make sure I got my barn right. Because you know, we know how that turns out. Maple pesos. Shiny pebbles. It's only five bucks, bro. Why you want it? You want Jim to pick one up for you too? Um, uh, what am I trying to do? You want to say something, but Jim will make you feel bad. What are you gonna say? He's not even watching. Okay, Rob wants a magazine too. After he goes to the doctor, he says everyone loves it here. They like what? They like uh, reading it. We 
we ain't gonna say Bruce. Yeah, on purpose. Because it's way back there. It's way back there. I just want to get it right, that's all. Hold on one second, and I'll turn it in a second. Give me one second. Because it's set off way off the road. You're tiny. You don't have to leave. The heck. The further back things are, the smaller they are, right? I think. If you had a magazine, it would be called, yep, that sounds about right. <laughs> Kind of, but in scale. Okay. Um. That would make my trees 400 feet. Oh, I see what you. Okay, hold on. Hopefully, I can fix that. Let's see. Let's see. It does kind of now that you said something. Um. Let's. Down. Make another bigger one. Don't choke over there. Crap. I just screwed that up. Just include that in as, say, a door or a window. Oh. Breathe, just trying to help you grow. I know. You're fine. You're fine. Oh no, I'm just I'm just thinking of how to fix it, that's all. Like I don't wanna mess it up. Okay, let's see. Um Amma 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 I'm easy to blend, okay. 
I'm just like because I know my buildings always wind up being screwed up so I was just trying to like make sure that it wasn't getting screwed up you know what I'm saying I'm not even gonna ignore you, be quiet. Stop saying it. I'm the one that's got the building issue, not you. Stop what? <laughs> um, let's see, hold on. Oh, I want There's a great dark side of the barn. Okay. Now build the barn. Okay. Alrighty then. Is that big enough? Yes, don't angle the brush. Hold on. My hair was getting in my face. Perfect size? Okay, good. Yay! Alright, now. Roof. Don't angle the brush. Keep the brush straight. Bob has Cheetos. I'm jealous. Right? Fudge. Oop, wait, you can't see that, do you? That one?
Really? Does that look right? You mean I dude it? Did I dude it? Yeah, it does look kind of right, doesn't it? It's kind of tall, but... Just angle left side down and... Just angle left side down at angle, not straight on the roof. In the back? In the back? Or in the front? Yes, I am. I think that's it. I gotta fix the front though, because the, the front's kind of going up like this. Doesn't look even, Steven. That's better. How much of a isn't that's not at an angle? It's not at an angle. Ew. Hello. Put another one more side of the barn there. I'll fix that. Hold on, I'll fix that. Let me just grab some red. My one weakness is buildings, and I want to like master them so bad. No, you didn't miss me all. But I think it's better than it was. Oh. You gonna take Ted out for a bed? <laughs> Ted's bed isn't outside. 
Okay, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> now it's not a doghouse. It could have been Snoopy's doghouse. Could have been Snoopy's doghouse. Wow, I just like threw my brush around. I'm not gonna rant about you being a jerk. You know better than that. Night, Bruce. Talk to you tomorrow. Making a little bit of gray here. Watercolors are fun. Remember, layers, not one pass. Okay. Yep, still learning. New learning curve. New learning curve. Just want to add a little bit of weather in here. Go back from dark. Okay. Night. Fatima was a party girl this weekend. Party girl. Party girl. Yeah, all the lightweight, Rob. I'll be here by myself soon. Yeah, what's the chance of that? It's a school night. <laughs> um,
that right there is funny. I was just going to ask what you thought. <laughs> And, and you know what I noticed too about watercolors? You can erase stuff. Like, you can erase things that you did by accident. Like, you know, say you want to erase this over here, you can just go and make it go away. Or move it over. You know? Or make it darker. Because I do have to make, kind of make some shadows for those trees, so. Yeah. Oh, she was? That's cool. Rob, you're very observant. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea how to paint. No clue whatsoever. Shadows for these trees, you know. You do have to let it dry in between, though, because it 
will get a bit soggy. Okay, Phantom, I will. Have a good night. I think I want to add some purple up there. If you want to call it that, Rob, I mean, I don't know what you want. You want to call it something, but... I'm not sure if it's painting or not. It's something, but I'm not sure what it is. Uh, maybe they're just sitting there because you know eventually you're going to call for them. So they figured they would just hang out by you so they wouldn't have to go that far? Which is a wild guess. Only you and me, Rob, so I think I'm the only one that can try and give you an explanation. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Jim likes watching loud videos for some reason. I'm not sure why. Hey, Sue. Trying my hand out of some watercolor paints there, so. Sue said hi, my love. A little louder. Ooh. Sue Beth has arrived. Wow. Bob just changed her name to Sue Beth. gonna fix that. Let's see. Wow, he guessed right. Look at that. I think he had some insider information. I'm just guessing. Insider information. What's new, Sue? What's going on? What's cracking? What's popping? I uploaded a new intro video to replace my other one. I had to upload it in order for me to post it on my channel page, which is kind of weird. I couldn't even just like pull it from my file from my folders, which was rude. Tree service guide came out today, so hopefully the tree will be taken down. Oh, that's good. I'm surprised you got them to come so early. I figured they'd be 
busy as heck. You know? Unless Bob knows a guy who knows a guy. Bob might know a guy who knows a guy. They're busy glad they called you back today. Bob is called several times this week. They're the ones who took down the tree in the front yard a couple of years ago. Yeah, Bob might know a guy who knows a guy. At the same time, he was here. Cable guy he was next door fixing something. Bob with them in there, and fixed their cable line. <laughs> After saying it wasn't cable, he fixed it. The heck! That doesn't make a lot of sense. What do you think it was? A phone line?
Mike said it was AT and T line. Bob said never had AT and T. Ha! All that lip for nothing. Just fix the stupid line. Trying to touch some stuff up and stop making it look like something I could have done in kindergarten. Keep wanting to drop the stupid brush. Thanks, Rob. I know it needs a couple of like piney type trees.
or something else. And of course, this camera doesn't do it, you know, anything close to what I'm seeing. Let's see if I can do this successfully without making a big mess here. So let's start with some brown. Excuse me. Um, Might have to go back to the wider brush. Let's go back to the wider brush. And a little bit of this. Um, you know, this is just out of my head. 
I mean, I started this with Bruce last Friday. Because he bought his water, he brought his watercolor kit over to the campground. So this is just finishing up what um, I started. And of course, like, you know, like he said, you have to do it in layers. So it's like you have to paint one thing, wait for it to dry, then do the later layer on top, wait for that to dry. It's not like acrylics where you could just like put three different greens together and it comes out like it should. I'm new to this. This is like starting all over again, yeah? Starting from day one all over again. I'll eventually start painting the pictures that I took while we were up there. Yeah, I just have to pick which one. I took so many freaking pictures, it was like, oh my god. Unlike acrylics, which dry darker than 
let you start off with these dry lighter than what you start out with. So... I'm just going by what he's told me so far. Really? <laughs> I don't think he was even in the village people. Suplerts at YMCA. She crazy. Yeah, what do you think? Should I stop? Should I? Does he think it needs something else? I need input, people. I need input. The first question I'm going to get asked is why are there pine trees in the middle of a field behind a barn? Because they were the only ones that didn't get blown over. Backstory, <laughs> it's all in the details. Right? It's all about the little details. I know what it needs. It just came to me. Just came to me. Hopefully I can pull this off.
Let's try some of this. <laughs> Sue said pumpkins. My pumpkins would look like little orange balls. Little orange balls. Yep. I'm going with that. Have you stormproofed up? Nope, too much water. Too much water. Guess you can't do that. I'm going to try it this way. There's got to be a way to do it. Bob needs to be stormproofed. to the grass here because kind of looks like it's flat some floaties to them, right? Right? I'm not editing myself very well with this. He's about ready to get the ladder and climb the tree and start taking it down branch by branch. We didn't have flooding. How old is that tree, Sue? Do you know? Or does he know? How long it's been there? Is it dead? See, this tree washed out. Dang it. Shannon's back. What did the urgent care say, Shannon? Kicking your butt doing what? What? You may have broken your knee. Well, obviously, they took freaking x-rays, so either you did or you didn't. You're still fired. Oh, you play word jumps, okay. They didn't. Then what the heck did they do? You were there for two, and, two hours and... Two hours, let's say. What did they do?
Yeah, it is work. Oh, yeah, it is working this compound. Your boss is gonna love that one. So you're gonna have to go to their doctor. Blah blah blah. Yeah, that's not fun. Oh, okay. That's a good thing. She was about seven feet tall when he moved here 23 years ago. Uh, okay, so the roots were probably pretty shallow then. It's just like we don't have dirt here. What dirt? What's that? What is dirt? Yeah, you missed a lot of interesting conversation there, Shannon. Just saying. I love my work when people close the door. <laughs> Oh yeah, you missed all kinds of fun. Just about 
Bob was ranting about work. Bruce was trying to figure out what kind of crazy pumpkin, um, crazy Halloween painting he's going to make. Um, what else? And I'm just here, like, finishing up my barn and stuff. <laughs> exactly, Rob. Exactly. Because that's what we do. It was the Garden State Paint Rant Night. He said it was ice cream. We said no, it wasn't. You know, all that fun stuff. Who hasn't made a single inappropriate comment? <laughs> right? So have some ice cream. Have some ice cream there, lady. of misery and hatred with vanilla flavoring. Yeah, right? It was. Oh my. Shannon, you were out. You should have stopped at the store. The heck? You're fired again. Again, you're fired. I fired Shannon like 12 times today. Somebody took you to the stupid doctor? Should have had them. Stop and get you ice cream. What the heck? God, do I have to think of these things for you? so done with you. So done with you. <laughs> she, she may have broken her knee and her brain takes a crap instead. Got it. Okay, I understand how that works. Team Tin need help these days. <laughs> Done with you. Done with you. Mm. 
Well, she hasn't said dude yet, which I'm surprised about. Help me, please. <laughs> You're fired. <laughs> you are fired. I told you. I'm not fired. You're fired. She's yelling at me. You're funny smelling. Told you to take a shower. Again, I have to think of all these things for you. Somebody help me out here. <laughs> Hi, Liv. Yeah. Oh, okay. She took one before work. What about after work? Sue, Rob, you want to chime in on this, please? I'm well aware of this. She's a crazy, crazy chicken lady over here. <clears throat> crazy chicken lady. <laughs> What's your husband's name? <laughs> hey, Kevin. <laughs> Speaking of chicken, and what color are these eggs? What's the matter, Kevin? What are you doing? Sue, I was asking for your help with Shannon and you just did not come to my rescue. The hell? Kevin, you should be in bed. It's past your bedtime. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, Rob. Only if you feel like it. So go to bed, Kevin. What the heck? I gotta, tell, gotta think of everything for you, too. Bad enough, I have to be Shannon's brain today.
have to get the smaller brush out. He's going to fake it, Shannon. Don't worry. Is this gray? Oh, you were taking roll call? Okay. That's what she says. She's a mess, I say. She's a mess. Kevin, see you tomorrow. I am live on the other channel tomorrow night. Oh, wait, he forgot. This one, a D-U-N done. D-U-N. Take a gander at it. You know what? I hate these stupid plastic zipper things. The heck. Be all kinds of delicate with them and everything. Thanks, lady. You can expect a full blown Well not now because you hurt your damn self. gonna do that I can sit comfortably there is the whole butt thing going on. Uh, she's funny comfortably without being in pain Oh my god, I can't with her.
guess I should sign that. I guess I should sign it. Not signing it in watercolor. Sign it in acrylic pen. I would like to say that these watercolors, this watercolor palette looks like eyeshadow. So you're working Thursday through Sunday. No, it's not really pastel, past, past, pastelli, past, past, pastelli. Sounds like an Italian pasta dish or something. Uh, 9.22. Oh, it's 10.22. Whoa. What month am I in? There we go. It's not really pastel -y. I'll show you. Shannonisms. Sue, now you can look at it. It's not pastel -y. It does have pink, which is Shannon's favorite color ever. But it's not pastel -y. It's it's the only palette that Michael's had that wasn't fifty dollars. You know what I'm saying? This is thirty six colors. Michael's had ones that were like ten or twelve colors and they were fifty bucks. You do love pink. You're a pink kind of gal. <laughs> yeah, 50 bucks. I am not joking. They're watercolors. Just because they came in a handy little travel case. Well, this kind of looks like a handy little travel case to me. <laughs> I've smurfed some mushrooms. I like bread and butter. I like toast and jam. I love smurfs and mushrooms. But anyway, my peeps... It's all I got for today. You need a crochet idea? Milkshake. A milkshake. A knee brace. Some bubble wrap. <laughs> ah. Oh, you made a soda. <sighs> yeah, that's... How about a cane? Some crutches? I don't, I'm trying to help you out here. A walker. Um, hospital bed, band aid. 
<laughs> I could keep going. Yeah, Walker, exactly. See? All right, peeps, let me get off of here. Of course, that's what I'm good for, right? I try. But I will see you all tomorrow night after Sue and Bob. Shannon, make sure... That you go over and subscribe to Sue and Bob's channel, Lucky Dog Productions. They're on tomorrow night at 6 o'clock, and then I'll be on at 7 o'clock. <clears throat> it's a pretty fun chat over there. Oh. Yeah, I'd say you gotta get that fixed. Text you when. Well, do it now. Do it right now before I get off. Sue, drop your link, please. Yeah, I answered it. Drop it like a knee. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. There you go. There you go, Shannon. Thanks for hanging out, guys. We'll see you tomorrow night. And then Shannon can get her double dose of laughter. Once at 6 o'clock and once at 7 o'clock. 6 o'clock Eastern, that is. Eastern. Because we know she's on that. Thanks, Shannon. Let me drop it there. Here we go. Yes. We'll make you forget about your knee and think about your ribs because they'll be hurting from laughing so much. But we see you all tomorrow night. Thanks for hanging. And maybe I'll give it away. Maybe I won't.
the clean air side. She's funny. She's got jokes. See you later, alligator. In a while, crocodile. Good night, peeps. Have a great night.